from posterior view of the larynx, here the epiglottis, which is covered, epiglottic uh, cartilage, epiglottis cartilage, which is covered with a mucous membrane. This is the ari epiglottic fold. These two from this side and this side, ari epiglottic fold from the arytenoid name comes from the arytenoid and the epiglottis are epiglottic fold. This is too small lateral prominence is the area for the uh, cuneiform li uh, cartilage. This is a cuneiform cartilage and this is the other cuneiform cartilage. Here the two small prominent area here the corniculate cartilage, two corniculate cartilage which is a prominence here. This is the area for the cuneiform. Uh, corniculate cartilage. Here, the arytenoid cartilage, which is like pyramid. This is the base that is attached to the cricoid cartilage, and this is the apex, which is attached uh, to the corniculate cartilage. This one is the muscular process, where the muscles attach to it. This is the muscular process. Okay. And this small overlap is the ligaments that connect the cricoid to the uh, arytenoid cartilage. Okay. This two foci is the pyriform fossa. Okay, pyriform recess or pyriform fossa. And this is fat part, which is in yellow color. This cut surface for the thyrohyoid membrane. This is also thyrohyoid membrane. And this is the hyoid bone, which is the greater horn. This is the uh, small cartilage, tarticial cartilage, superior horn of the thyroid cartilage. And this is the thyroid cartilage here, the cut surface. This is the inferior horn of the cricoid cartilage. This is the foramen for the visual and the nerve, which is the superior laryngeal artery and the internal branch of the superior laryngeal nerve. Those muscles that overlie the arytenoid is called arytenoid muscles. Exactly this one, obvious, this one is the horizontal. Here the cut surface of the horizontal, our transverse, transverse part. Well, this one is the oblique, okay? This one and this one is the oblique, which is cross shape. This nerve is the recurrent laryngeal nerve comes from inferiorly to superiorly. This cartilage is the cricoid cartilage. Exactly, this is the lamina of the cricoid cartilage. And here, the attachment to the superior horn of the uh, thyroid cartilage. This muscle, this muscle is the posterior cricoarytenoid muscle that's inserted into the uh, muscular process of the arytenoid cartilage. More inferiorly here is the posterior part of the uh, uh, tr uh, trachea ring, which is defect from any cartilage. There is no cartilage posterior. Cut.